So both cats and dogs have quicks in their nails, which are the blood vessel that goes to the end of their nail. Cats and some dogs that have white or clear nails, it's very easy to see the quick and so it's easy to avoid it. However, a lot of dogs do have black nails and for those dogs, I would start conservatively and only cut off the very sharp um, end part of their nail. This is a common nail trimming device for dogs. As you can see, it's pretty heavy duty and you can get through their tough nails pretty easily. It will also work on cats, but it's a little large than we need. This is my favorite instrument for cutting cats' nails. It's much smaller and you can handle it pretty simply. And then this is another device you'll see in pet stores where you put the nail through the middle and get better visualization of where it's going to cut so you can avoid the quick. And lastly, it's always nice to have something on hand in case you were to hit the blood vessel, also known as the quick, that's in their nails. This is something you can also find at a pet store. It's aseptic powder with a little local anesthetic in it that you can have spread out and put their nail in there if it's bleeding. Other at-home remedies include cornstarch and flour if you, if you don't have any of this on hand.